Hey, yeah, we're in the veg garden on the 4th of April and it's a fruit day again so we're doing peas at the moment. Um, it's, uh, this, the, those veg gardens have been cultivated for 15 years so the soil is really nice. We hardly have to do anything about it. And we had carrots in here before um, and we've thrown some ashes on the uh, ground because that's very good for peas. Um, for the nat natri natrium? Nutrients. Nutri no, for what kind of, what is it again? For the ashes, what do they do? Uh, ashes have phosphorus. Phosphorus. And that's what <laughs> the peas like. And potassium, I believe they're both. So this is our fruit box again. The tomatoes I did the other day. And these are beans. And all our peas are out. And we're trying to figure out what we do where. And then, of course, I make uh, like nice schedules where goes what. So we remember... This is in my polytunnel. Um, and then so this is uh, the first row that we've... This one is done. So we covered the seeds um, and this one is nicely done. And then here you can see the seeds on top. A little bit spread out. All the way to the other end. And we have to cover this one still. And you see here that Stephen is raking or how do you... Forking through the soil uh, to make it nice and loose. And that's especially because we have a clayey ground. And if there's a lot of rain, the rain will, would like sit in those little gullies and then the piece could rot. So we're making it loose so the uh, water drains away. And then here there's one uh, with the method done but not forked yet. And here there's one done. Could you demonstrate the method, Christine? So I've method on one side and then you do the other side like so. And then so you make a little gully. And then you do the forking. And then here is another one to be. So that's it. So another one to be. Half one with the methoc. Then fork it over like this. Right. Uh, four foot between the rows. Four foot between the rows. Um, and then you put the peas in. And then you cover them. There you go. Sewing peas. Ta -ta -ta -ta. And we make them in gullies. <laughs> so that they do catch some water. And also that we can put... Uh, I'm sorry. That they, and that we, we one, between one another. The varieties. Yeah, so do we do a small one first and then a tall one and then a small one and a tall one so we see the difference between them because we do different varieties. Right, cool. I think that's it. Ciao, ciao.